The restaurant report card is only on CBS 46 and tonight the health department discovering serious violations at a popular Vietnamese restaurant. But first our Adam Murphy gets things started at an Italian spot with a perfect score. Bon Appetito, we're at Il Giallo on Roswell Road in Sandy Springs this week. Authentic Italian, they've been here now for four years. You're gonna love this place when you come in, it's so cozy, you feel like you're somewhere in Europe, and the food is amazing as well. And you know what's really neat too? The first Saturday of every month, you can take a pasta class. People come in, they learn how to make delicious pasta, and then they can enjoy their meal right afterwards. I'm gonna tell you about all the items on the menu in a moment, but first, Here's this week's Best and Worst Scores. On South Central Avenue in Fulton County, this Hapeville restaurant is in some hot water. Two of Vietnamese failed a surprise inspection with 61 points and a U for unsatisfactory. The report says meats were left out at room temperature to thaw. Plus, turkey, chicken, and pasta were at unsafe temperatures. And the cook picked up raw meat, then vegetables, without changing gloves. When you go from one food item to the next, you understand you have to now change your do, gloves. Right? Management said they corrected most of their violations, but still have more work to do after scoring 83 points and a B on a reinspection. People want to know, is it safe to eat here now? It's safe 100%. Now to some other scores. In Cobb County, cookout on Chastain Road in Kennesaw picked up a 94. And in Gwinnett County, Culver's on Buford Drive at the Mall of Georgia earned 96 points. And here at El Jalo on Roswell Road in Sandy Springs, they scored a 100 on their last health inspection. So congratulations, they are the winner of this week's Golden Spatula Award. Everything coming hot out of that kitchen, so let's get right to the menu. You can start out with the arugula salad. They have the duck pasta, salmon, over here the octopus, and look at the spaghetti with meatballs. Doesn't that look good? But I hear the veal parmesan is absolutely to die for, and that's what I'm going with. We'll see you all next week. Wow. Boy, that's good.